Hey RevFam, welcome to your daily chart for Friday, May 24th. Let's start with Gemini. All right, the sun is in a week trine with Pluto. A lot of stuff got in your way today, but if you look closely at every one of those things, they all have to do with healing somehow. It has to do with renewal. Either you got taken care of, you had to take care of someone, or you found out what you need to be taken care of. Hey Capricorn, the moon has moved on and is now in Aquarius and we still have a pretty strong sextile between Saturn and Neptune. So your intuition is high. You should use it. But also you got a little, you know, pick me up when it comes to work or your career or being known in the world. It was a gift. You're like, oh wow, that was nice. Good things continue. Hey Aquarius, the moon has moved into your sign and now is in a strong square with Venus, which is in Taurus. So that's friction. Sparks can fly. Mm, romantic agitation, if you will, creative agitation, but in a good way. You just wanna make sure that your skin, which is very soft, is protected, meaning your inner self is protected from the friction. Does that make sense? Pisces, Saturn is in a strong sextile with Neptune, which is in your sign. And for you, it's a good day. You could start some great projects today, things that will be very profitable down the line. Also, you're motivated to move things along at home. Just make sure that you're not being too pushy in the home environment. I know, I'm just saying, just take a second to see how the other person might be feeling about what you do. Sagittarius, Jupiter is in a square with Neptune, which means that you are feeling compassion for your fellow human. If there's some project you've been thinking of putting out along those lines, go ahead and do so today. A blog post, a post, maybe starting a new group. Something has been compelling you to speak up on social issues and today is a great day to get started. Ooh, Scorpio, you want to make some big changes today, but can I ask you if you're spending too much money? I feel like when you guys have great business deals, it's amazing, and you feel the sense of relief, and you're like, ah, oh, that was awesome. But then, you know, the anxiety starts to build again because then you spend, like, extravagantly sometimes, right? Libra, you're also being asked about changes at home today, changes in your status as a couple or single or married. There's a lot of talk today about how you label you, and there's a lot of people around you who want to label and own you, which I think is hilarious because we know how you get when people act like that. Jeez, haven't you met Libras before? Virgo, if you have a friend who's trying to give you some advice today about laying low or not being petty or not reacting to something that's meant to get a rise out of you, you should probably listen to them only because I think it's having an effect on how people see you, but most importantly, how your partner sees you. When you engage in petty, you become equal. Is that what you want? Leo, today's a great day for you to get a lot done. Business is going well, money looks good, and then bam, right in the middle of it, you have people asking you to switch speeds because now they want attention. And you understand attention better than anyone, but like, come on, can everyone get their life today and let you work? Just because it's Friday doesn't mean that, you know, it's time to just... Cancer, Mars is in strong sextile with Uranus. So you have all this energy. You want things to happen. You can see them in your head and you're like, okay, this is how it should be. Where is it? You guys are kind of feeling like how Scorpios were the other day, but all three of the water signs want to change things in their love lives and just in their personal lives and their home environment today. If other people can't necessarily see your vision today, just remember they've had to deal with you being pretty sad lately. 
Taurus. So Venus is in a weak conjunction with Uranus. Ah, love at first sight. Ooh, ah, the finances come through. Hey, who's that? Oh my God, they like me too? Wait, what? Who wants to talk to me? Wait, did you check your email? Huh, I texted you earlier. Wait, what'd you say? Where are we going? It's also exciting, it's also fun. How much good luck can one person have? I'm telling you, Gemini season for Taurians is lit. Aries, today's a great day to make a list of what you want out of the next six months of the year. It's also a great day to give people advice because your business sense is on. You look into the future today and you can see what is feasible and what isn't. And it's a beautiful feeling because you're rushing into the future just like Aries likes to do. And what you find in the future is profitability and abundance. Okay, RevFam, that was a look at the sky for today, a little snapshot for you. Happy birthday to anyone celebrating a birthday today. We love you. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.